Hello, Nate here. Welcome back to more Paper Mario on your door. Last time, we made it through. Like we we were, were trying to get the the mayor said rune stones. We need them in order to get them. We have to come this way. Guy opened the gate. We went down here, visited some ruins, and now we're here. This time, we're gonna talk to this guy and see what the heck is going on. Oh man. <laughs> You're the first contestants I've seen in a while. You must want the sun and moon stones. If that's the case, then you must compete against me. If you win, I'll let you through to where the stones rest. However, if you lose, you will suffer a terrible fate, and by terrible, I mean awful. <laughs> So, what do you want to do? I'll take you on, Headstrong! Take on anyone! <laughs> You're in for it now. Oh, I wonder how this transition... Oh, there it is! Uh, they did it flawlessly. They did the transition great. Oh, man. Just like how... Better than what I remember. Hey, hey, it's that time again. Welcome, everyone, to the 65th Trivia Quiz Off. Um, um, what, what the heck are we on? Uh, if you correctly answer five of the following questions, you'll win. But get three wrong, you'll suffer. Now, for the first question, what's hidden here in Shrunk Fortress? I mean, he said it already. The Sun and Moon Stones. Sun and Moon Stones? Is that your real answer? Are you sure? How far will the camera zoom in? How far will it zoom in? I, I, we got, I got our new. Uh, and that's it. Okay, well, yes. Yeah, got it right. Uh, uh, that's correct. That question was too easy, but it, get, it only gets harder from here, much harder. So prepare yourself. On to question two. What do one mushroom and one flower, fire flower, cost at the shop at the pedal bird? Total. Um, five and eight, right? I think it was five and eight. The fire flower cost eight. It was cheaper. But the mushroom is the same, right? Five and eight? Oh, wait, no, five and eight isn't even an option. Uh, it's not 13, so it must be 12 then. Yeah, maybe it's eight and four. Maybe that's what it is. Well, coins, is that your real answer? Are you sure? Yes. Yeah, I knew it. Dang. The, the episode where I actually went into that shop was like a week ago. So, yeah, I'm surprised I remember that. Uh, that's correct. That's quite too easy. But it only gets harder for her. Oh, sorry. So, prefer a. Moving on, question three. What is the name of Mayor Petterberg? Uh... Kroop. That's what his name was. I remember this. Yes. Yeah. Ah, that's correct. That uh, question was too easy. It makes it much harder. Blah, 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 blah. We're not done yet, folks. Question four. Tell me now, where is the crystal star? Yeah, it's a castle. Cocktail Castle. That your answer? Yeah. Just cut cut to the chase, guys. Come on. Ah, right again. Tell me you didn't just get your fourth right answer. It can't be true. That's it. I'm making a rest near impossible. Get ready for the brain pain. Are you ready for the diabolical question five? How can one get to report to Metal Petal Meadows? Oh. The pipe. Racing a cart. Pipe, is that your answer? Yes, that's how I got here. Yeah, no, that's correct. No, you correctly answered five questions. I don't believe it. You win, you're the first ever contestant to win, and all the other ones got squished by me, and they all died. Ah, uh, okay, anyway. So very angry. I can't believe I lost. I guess I have to let you through. Stupid rules. Thank you. Thank you. 
Alright, we're gonna save, so I don't have to do that again. Heck yeah. Check out the, uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you like what you see, and ring the bell if you want to be notified whenever I upload a video. Check out, check out the description for more, for playlists of games that I've played that you might like. Oh man, oh, they changed it. Um, so, one of the things about this soundtrack, the older version of the first version of this game as I was a kid, is that I always like to see, like, so you got water here, right? I always like to see, I always like to see, like, the, the feet move, like, in the water, because it got wobbly in the water. You just, like, caught, like, saw it move, and I was like, oh, he's dancing to the song. I don't know. I always thought of it, I always thought of it that way. Anyway, we just got a badge. A new one. So, but can we equip it? Sure we can, because it only costs one. Multi-bounce. What this means is, where are you to use multi-bounce? It costs two. So, you can use this to do what exactly? It'll use, it'll let you attack multiple foes in order by successfully executing, successfully executing action commands. So we can attack, we can jump each enemy in a line. So it doesn't matter which way we go, we're going to go both ways anyway, but I always started by going this way. And we're going to see our first new enemy. It's the fuzzy. It's the fuzzy. These guys make an appearance, multiple appearances in the later Mario games. This is the most, this is one of the most memorable enemies I've ever seen. So, Gubella, tell us about these guys. That's a fuzzy. What a hyper little guy. What a hyper little guy. He's just a little guy. What a hyper little guy, huh? Cut back on the caffeine. That's a base 3, Tiger Swans up there. Those things suck up your HP and you use it to replenish their own. Isn't that the worst? I mean, ew. Doesn't that sound totally gross? Anyway, sounds like you need to use Action Guard Command when they release it. The timing is pretty hard to master, so uh, practice up. These things really suck. HP. These things really suck. HP. Alright. Anyway, let's go ahead and... Oh, we can do the multi bounce. Here we go. This is how this looks. So we can go... Oh. And of course, do the stylish in the process. Ooh, is he dizzy? Is that what that is? Oh, oh, I, 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 I forgot how that worked for a second there. So I have to like press it after he does the part. All right. Uh. Anyway, watch this. The stylish. I can do it now. Look. Yeah. The stylish Goombella flippies. We did the flippies, and now we win these. Anyway. Anyway, they're not too bad. They're pretty cool. Pretty easy. Oh, we got a little flower. Partner hint. What's the partner hint? Where could the, where could the sun and moonstone be? Let's move on for now. Where could I set up on that? Oh, we got more. Die! Die! Bingo! Bingo! Will I get bingo this time? Oh, wait. After this guy's attack. Oh, wait. It's different. Wait. That, I was going to do the guard, but I, I didn't realize that the, the animation for them attacking is like actually different like you only go like they like squeeze and go and then they like pull and then you do it but they made it so it's faster so now i gotta get used to that timing anyway let's get this right this time it's right after the green right after the green yeah, yeah. bingo so whenever you get a bingo you always get what the thing is but I barely, I didn't even need the HP one, but you always get a full audience after you do that, which is always pretty cool. Anyway, that guy's dead. And I think we're over oh, one away from a level up. We are, we are one away from a level. That's crazy. Anyway, let's go ahead and freaking finish off that guy. I can't believe I gotta actually get used to that, the new timing for the fuzzies now. Gosh dang. Alright, anyway, there it is. It's the 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 sunstone. This it's Pokemon Sun. Oh man! Oh, I, I'm definitely gonna use items in this one. I, I have I have not been using my items. I need to use these freaking items, man. All right, here we go. Like, don't be afraid. Cause they, they do a lot of damage. Like, come on. All right, a mystical stone shaped like the sun. Oh, forced battle. All right. Oh, that's a lot of them. You can't flee this fight. Oh, look how angry they are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> can't flee this fight. I sure can't, but I can kill them all. Just like that. 
All right, and I can actually take down one of them. Boom. Hey, we got, we got, we're lined up for another bingo. I still have no idea how that's supposed to work. Like the bingo thing. Like, how do I, can I control that somehow? There we go. I'm, I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get it a little bit. All right. Uh, oh, I'm all, I'm all out of FP. Okay. Uh, in that case. Oh, you know what? In that case, how about I just use a freaking item? I should have. Wait. So Pat Block does two damage. I should have. I should have did the multi bounce and then used a freaking block block. But anyway, this will just kill them all. So I should just. I should have just started with this to begin with. There we go. Every t when I was a kid, and every time every time I used an item, I always thought there was like an action command that came with it, but no. Anyway, this time we're gonna level up the FP. We're gonna go FP this time. Last time we did badge points, now we're gonna go flower points. So let's go ahead and get that because I'm I'm running out too fast. All right. Give me all the stars that don't matter because my freaking bar is full anyway. All right. Thank you, and I can I can pick up I pick back up my mushroom. Let's go. Now we just gotta make it all the way to, back to the other side. Also, one thing one thing I noticed uh, the speed on land and in this water is the same. I think it used to be slower when you're in the water in the in the original version. But now we want to go this way. Oop. This way. Yeah. Get out! Oh. Yeah. Partner hint. We still don't know where the Moonstone is. Let's move on for now. Yep. And kill this guy. Get that guy out of here. All right. I don't think there are any secrets in these hallways. It's just, just. It's, I think it's just go. Mushroom. Uh, do I have space for that? I do. Let's go. All right. Moonstone! Mystical stone shaped like the moon. Now we can play Pokemon Moon version. Alright, now we got, and we got this required battle, but check this out. Watch this. The power of using items have never been easier. Fire flower! Oh, well, actually, wait, no. Wait, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Actually, I, I want to save the fire flower, because fire, fire flower is strong. Let's use multi-bounce and then the power block instead. All right, and now we can use the item, the power of items, getting rid of everybody in one go. Get out. Oh, the background went up right there. Power blocks also have a high chance of making the backdrop fall. You remember that. All right, yeah. And I guess that's it. And now we head back to the, to the main room and freaking get out of here. And nothing will happen. For sure, nothing is going to happen, guys. Nothing's gonna happen. Calm down, everybody. Calm down, everybody. Calm down. Everything's fine. Oh, Mjork. Hey, suspicious types. This is our place. Wait, <laughs> I, I could, I could imagine this having like the the Rick and Morty voice or the Morty voice. You suspicious types. This is our place. And coming here, it's rude, rude. rude. I'm sorry, suckers. If you want a warm welcome, too bad. I, I now I lunch on your head. Super guard. Oh, I can't do it now. We got a mini boss. It's mini boss time. Full audience and can't please fight. Look how angry he is. So angry. All right, Goombella. What the heck is that thing? Why is it yellow? Why is there a yellow fuzzy? That's a that's a gold fuzzy. Whoa, those types are super rare. I'm serious. Wow. Match HP is 10, attack is 1, defense 0. Oh, but hey, even though it's a fuzzy, it won't suck up your HP, which is nice. I have to wonder though, how does the thing hide? Look at it. It's so gaudy. Yep, yep, it's uh golden. It's like an al it's an albino fuzzy, but albino it means yellow in this game. Freaking belly flops the floor as a stylish move. 
Oh, oh my god, I forgot about that. Okay, I wasn't ready for that. Even though Gabella just told me it doesn't suck HP, I completely forgot. <laughs> me, oh, hey, ow, chumps are tougher than you look, but I'm not through yet. Everyone, get him. Oh my god. Oh, he's hiding in there somewhere. But, uh... But, uh... Wait. Is... I can target the Horde or the Gold Fuzzy. I don't know why I wouldn't target the Horde. Let's get the Gold one. Uh, I guess it makes it harder to time the commands, though. Oh, a bucket just fell on him. Yep, I remember this. Do it to the beat. Oh, I pressed... I No, I, I pressed it. I pressed it, man. Come on. Anyway, can you... Oh, you can. Okay. Go, Bella. What is this? What the heck is this? It's a fuzzy heart. Look at them all. What a mob scene. The fuzz is a buzz. Max HP is 20, attack is 1, defense is 0. Fuzzy, fuzzies come at you all at once and, at and attack in order. Says here not to freak out. It also says if you use good timing to defend, you won't take much damage at all. I'm thinking it might just be faster just to whip the ringleader though, like, you know? Yeah, just, we don't even need to kill that. We just need to focus on the golden guy. Well, let's go ahead and, yep. Yeah. Ah, there we go. All right, one more of these hordes. Yeah, flawless. 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 And he's dead. He's only got, he's only got one. I don't, I don't even have to press anything. I'm just let, just let it go. Boom. That's it. 20 experience or 20 star points. Star points is basically experience. Like, come on. Me or me are uh, you got you got me. And then they all go away. And you can watch them go. Yep. So glad they they kept this in where you can just like walk around as they go through the walls. Anyway, let's freaking get out of here. And now all we gotta do is save, of course. And then head all the way back to where we need it need to be. To the beginning of before Petalberg. Oh. Professor, frankly. Sounds like you got an email. I forgot all about the email system. Well, sounds like you got an email, Mario. Press plus to open the email. You should check it out. Press plus to open your email. I just said that. You can also check your email under the mailbox SP in the menu. If you want, some folks just like menus, you know. Yeah, or I can just press plus right here. Mario, you work it hard. Professor Frankly here in e form. It's highly likely you'll receive emails like this while like this one while you're on your journey. So check your mail often. I actually have nothing more to say, and that's all I hope goes for you. Anyway, I look forward to getting crystal stars of most information, and I'm gonna take a quick selfie. Oh, uh, is this how the kids do it these days? Look at me with my glasses and my freaking, oh, my freaking ancient book. When I was a kid, I thought those were his eyes, not his glasses. Anyway, it, we gotta make it all the way back to the beginning. But not after, take, not before taking out this guy. And we're back at Petterberg. And we got a new email. Oh, I pressed it too late. Uh. Where is it? I've, I've, where, where is it? Uh, in here. I remember. I remember. Anyway, we got, we got to remember. RDM registration, direct email verification. Dear Mario, thanks for registering with Rogue for direct mail service. Your kind friend, Mr. Frankly, referred you to us. Our direct mail service will provide you with regular, timely news updates. We hope you enjoy our service, and we will definitely send you freaking ads for every product in existence. Hope you enjoy. Anyway, let's head on over this way. And now we can freaking, uh, I mean, on the way back, I did battle like all the things. I got like 85 star points now. So now 
we can put the sunstones into the freaking the rocks that we saw right when we entered. So let's go ahead and do that, but not before getting interrupted by, um, excuse me. It's uh, Mario, right? Look, I, uh, the thing is, I've been waiting here in hope of getting to speak with you. Oh, oh see, I, I was wondering, would you? Oh, please take me with you, please, to fight him down, please, I'm begging you. Sorry about that. You see, my dad, he went off the Battle Hotel long ago and never came back. I miss him, of course. I miss him badly. But it isn't just about my average, avenge my, avenging my dad. Well, no, that's not true. Revenge is part of it, but I guess a, a big part. But the truth is, I want to finish what my dad started for his sake, for everyone's sake. Oh, yeah. Okay. I, man, this is embarrassing. See, everyone ever, always says I'm a crybaby, cry baby, a weakling. But if I could defeat Hucktail, well, I won't be those things. I'll be strong, like my dad. I know I'll be dangerous, but I still want to go, Mario. Please, no! What? But, but why? Is there any way I could use to change your mind? No! Well... If that's how you feel, I'm not giving up hope, though. I promised myself I would. Um, so, if you change your mind, let me know, okay? I'll be over there polishing my shell. Can't have an adventure without a doll shell. Wait, wait, you can I, wait, can I actually? Can I actually? What? I didn't know you could do this. I, I think you could, I don't think you could do this in the original version, but Heck yeah, come, come with us. Are you taking me along? Yeah, come on. For real? No kidding? Yes, thank you so much. You won't regret this. I wonder if you could just have like a Goombella run only. Cool, let's join your party. Coop's abilities, a primer. Press X to send Coop's flying forward inside a shell. His shell can bump into things, which allows him to retrieve distant items and activating switches. Press X to send him flying. But good. You got a coin. A free coin. You hold X and keep him in place for a while. After keeping him in place, you can release X to snap him back to hit something behind his starting point. Try doing it. Okay. Mario can also move around while Cubes is in place. I still can press a switch from a distance. Try using X and move around. Oh yeah! Woo. Okay, so remember, when you send him flying, you can hold X and keep him in one place. That concludes the primer. You understand everything? Yes, I mastered them. In battle, he can use his shell toss to attack with his body or strike all ground bound foes for the power shell. Swap partner in the field by press X and go to the party tab. Yep, Koops is I think I like Koops. He's I think he's like my second favorite partner. I I think I think he's yeah I I like I like him. Okay Mario, let's get going. Koops oh. oh I remember this part. Oh oh golly um hi uh, hi Koopy Koopy Koo, did you overhear all that? Well, part of it, Koops, I thought I heard you say you're off the fight hotel, but you're joking, right? I mean, you're not exactly a powerhouse. She'll eat you up. I know, Koopy Koo, but I want to be tougher for you. No, Koops, you don't. I mean, going off to some dangerous place, it's... It's suicide. It's stupid. Why is Koops going to Hotel Castle? Is he stupid? So what if you're timid and sort of a cryberry? I don't care about all that. I just want you to be you, so don't go. Sorry. I've made up my mind. I'll be fine. After all, I'm traveling with Mario and... Fine! Ignore me! Stubborn Koopa! I remember that. Stubborn Koopa! Yeah, there it is. Stubborn Koopa! Uh. I'm sorry, Koopa Koo. I swear to you, I'll come back to you stronger than ever. Well, Mario, that's that. I guess no turning back. Hook tells Castle awaits. Oh, yeah. yeah. 
and then after that we can play Dungeons and Dragons. Hello, Mario. Oh wait, no. <laughs> Hello, Mario. Still working hard, Professor. Frankly, your e form again. I do have to say, as it turns out. I am once again asking for your financial support. Kubella was eager to join your side, and she won't be able. She won't be the last. I'm sure you'll gain a bunch of additional partners as you explore the world and progress through the harrowing adventure. If you do, if you do, there's a quick way to swap which partners walking alongside you. Just hold down L, access a doodad called the partner ring. You'll be able to get yourself in a, a stuck in a rut under the progress, angles in the panic stricken. First, calm down. The swap pals and even the partner ring, explore a bit more, see if anything clips into place. The noble knock of yours. One other thing, I'm betting you usually pop into your menu by pressing minus or plus, but did you know you could actually open it with the Pacific bubble? Blah, 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 blah. Good luck out there. Right, I get it, I get it. But this is a new feature. I can hold down this, I can just go like this. Oh. This was this was not in the original at all. This is brand new, so that makes swapping out easier. Because before you had to like come in here and then do that and then do that and you can swap that way. But now it's just forget this. So easy, so cool. Get him, Coops. We're about to show you what Coops can do. Uh, I don't remember what his stylishes are. I think I do. Hang on, shell toss. There it is. There it is. Okay, there it is. But uh, there's a second part to that that I, I messed up, but it's pretty cool. I mean, get that guy out of here. Collect a bunch of experience. Like, I'm all, like, I, 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 I normally fight, like, all the enemies until they are worth, like, nothing. Like, if, there, if, if one, if each enemy is worth, like, one star point, then it's not worth fighting them. But let's go ahead and get this guy. All right, we can show off his second move, which is gonna be a waste, but hey, let's show it off. I always thought that you had to like, wait for it to charge up, but you could just do it on the first go. I, I thought maybe you held it down, like when I was a kid, my place for the first time, I thought, I thought you had to, for the, for the power shell, I thought you had to hold it down until it spun faster and faster and do more damage. That's not the case, you could just let it go immediately. Anyway, I can get him, get him, yeah. Anyway, I'll, I'm gonna try to stylish move. I'm gonna try to stylish Coop, Coop's move real quick. So if I just like jump on him. Whoop. Now check this out. Watch this. Yeah, he does a little spin and he goes like, yeah, I did it. Which is pretty cool. I remember this stuff. I remember this stuff. Yeah. All right. No! Die. And with that, we got a level up. Let's go. This time we're gonna do health. We're gonna keep. We're gonna keep a balanced. We're gonna try to keep a balanced uh, thing here. So we're gonna go HP. Even though I've been doing pretty good on HP, but hey, you never be too safe. All right, I get it. I get it. Move on. I get it. Gosh dang. <laughs> We're all not screen forever. Dried mushroom. It's useless, but I guess I got space for it. But it is. I think it's useful in like the cooking recipes when, whenever we get to that. Let's go ahead and put the freaking stones in. Sunstone. Sunstone goes in the square hole. No, it goes in a sun hole. Moonstone goes in the moon hole. Moonstone is in place. And now we got our first Koops puzzle. What does it say? Oh, I love the look of the freaking text box and the sound for this. Here beginneth the path of dread Hooktail Castle, weaklings retreateth. Ye, ye who seeketh to proceed a power of two must hitteth both switches simultaneously. And the challenge is easieth, peasieth, if ye Use the skill of a pedal bird Koopa. Yep, that's our hint. So we want to go like this, launch them that way, and then bow at the same time. And then the pipe crumbles away and reveals 
this pipe. And now, we're ready to go to Hooktail Castle in the next episode. I do hope you guys enjoyed watching. I always appreciate you watching, and have a good one.